Yeah, it's, it's a massive honour, obviously. Um, something you sort of you dream of as a, as a little kid growing up. You want to, you know, have the opportunity to represent, you know, the, the place you live and, and breathe. And yeah, it's, 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 you know, it brings great pride and it's more having family and friends and, you know, the crowd and everyone behind you, I think, is a massive sort of factor as well. But in general, it's a, it's a massive honour, yeah, to be able to, to wear, that, wear that badge. I'd probably say last or this season actually for the Wigan Warriors um, beating St Helens. It's the first time I'd, I'd beaten St Helens. You know, it's a <laughs> it's a local rivalry, so um, it was it was a great feeling finally beating Saints and being a part of the team that did that. So yeah, it'll probably be my best moment so far. Uh, I played for a team called Croydon Hurricanes. That's down south in in London. For for those who don't know. Um, yeah, that was a rugby league side as well. And then rugby union, I played for Blackheath as well. Probably be the inflictor. I'd have to say the inflictor, yeah. You know, as you see, you know, on the field, he's just a bit of a madman, really, and he's, he's, a, he's a tough guy. He gets some work done. Uh, so, yeah, I'd say the inflictor. Had to be an Indian. Can't beat an Indian. Uh, it was sort of a weekly thing. It used to be a weekly thing when I lived with my family. I had to get an Indian on a Sunday, so yeah, it can't be. A... Some would probably disagree, but I smash a corner. No, not on masala, but yeah, I probably get some hate for that. But favorite player would have been Sonny Bill Williams growing up. Uh, yeah, it's a bit of an idol for me, really. Someone I sort of looked up to as a kid, on and off the field. You know, he's he's done a lot uh, for the sport and both codes as well, which is which is really good. So yeah, be Sonny Bill Williams. Uh, well, I played both from sort of the age of six to about 18 um, and then at that age I sort of had to choose and I just preferred rugby league, you know, it was more a bit of a faster game and something I just I enjoyed playing more at the time. Um, Union was fun as well, to be fair, but I just thought rugby league was, was more for me and more suited to how I like to play. It would have been just playing for, for, the, for the Croydon Hurricanes, I think. Uh, I think it was a minis festival, I think maybe under sixes, under sevens or something. Uh, first run out of a few of my mates as well from, from around where we're from and yeah, just I think we won as well, which was which was good. That would be my first memory winning the, the sevens, under sevens tournament. Don't be afraid to be different. I feel like obviously there's routes in life which you want to take, but I feel like it's, it's okay to do things a little differently. I think everyone's got a different approach and a different journey in life, whether it's you know rugby or or anything you want to achieve, and I just feel like it's okay to be to be different and have your own sort of vibe and do your own thing, and yeah, just don't get, don't get too caught up in the set process. You know, there's always boundaries and stumbles along the way, but you know the end the end result's still the same. <laughs> I've got him. I've got him in my suitcase. Uh, yeah, Hilly borrowed me a pair the other day, and keep forgetting to bring them, so yeah, they're there, Haley. don't worry, I'll, I'll drop them to in about 20. Uh, that being the pitch, probably just the buzz you get off the crowd and being out there with your teammates as well, I think, you know, there's no better feeling than the crowd roaring and that sort of, you get a weird feeling in your belly that it's, you know, it's go time and having your, your mates and your, you know, the people you train with week in, week out next to you either side, uh, you know, in that fight with you is, is a great feeling and it's just, it's a weird feeling, it's hard to explain, but it's uh, almost like a butterflies feeling, but it's, it's a good feeling. I'd definitely say that's probably my best feeling, yeah. I wouldn't say I've got a preference as such. I think I've played back row a lot more of my life. I only picked up centre this, early this year uh, for, for Wigan for the first time ever. So if I'm going off what I'm used to, I'll probably say second row, however, uh, you know, I don't mind a challenge and it's, it's both, both positions are very different but, but I enjoy playing both to be honest and it's just extending my sort of, yeah, game. So I'll, I'll probably say, I'd like to say second row if I'm giving one answer, yeah. Uh, it would be the Super Bowl. Uh, yeah, I watch quite a bit of NFL and it's just, you know, it's a pretty good sport, a lot of hype. Uh, it's a massive event as well, you know, a lot of people, even in this country, stay up to watch it and on TV and stuff, so yeah, it just looks like a mad event. You know, there's a lot going on, it's crazy, and 
some freak athletes out there as well, which is a different sort of vibe to rugby, but it's something I definitely want to go to one day.